Sometimes I feel a bit like a walking, talking tourist attraction or like a avant-garde piece of art because uh, wherever I go, people stare. It doesn't really matter in what continent, country or city. And um, I think it's actually not about me, even though they treat me like a walking, talking Big Ben. And... They look at me, they stare, and they don't really know me. I haven't done anything, I haven't said anything, uh, but they react um, sometimes in a very positive way, other times in a very negative way, and I think it's really about them. They look at me and they react. It's almost like I'm holding up a mirror, and they just see themselves and they reveal something about themselves and I think in this case it's most likely what they feel about people who are different and let's face it there are so many people who are different I think some people look at me and they think she must be inferior to me in every possible way and if I uh, become her friend um, it will make me feel good about myself because some people uh, who approach me and who um, wanted to keep in touch and wanted to be friends they are they can't really be happy for me when something good happens and when they think I'm doing too well they will find a way to I guess sabotage or they don't want to hear it the way I see it we all have different potentials and we all have weaknesses so when people succeed just be happy for them and uh, it doesn't matter if a person call themselves a friend if they don't behave like a friend they're not a friend I remember once I was um, invited to a conference about albinism in Tokyo, Japan and um, I was one of the last speakers and in the audience um, there was a woman and she asked a question. She said that um, she's still in school, um, she has albinism, um, she felt that she couldn't quite be herself in the school she was very quiet didn't say anything didn't she didn't feel like she had any friends um so i said to her first of all i think it's very brave of you to ask that question what to do when you're in a situation like that and i said to her well actually when i was in school um i was very quiet too um I had friends, but in class, I didn't really speak or, or you know, uh, um, ask any questions or um, sort of volunteer with any information. But what I told her was, um, in time, especially after you left school, really, you will find your tribe, you will find friends, and you will be able to find out who you are and feel like you can be yourself. Um, I think if it's like that for you, somewhere out there, just know that it happened to me too. Um, it takes time sometimes, but you will find your friends, um, you will find your family, so to say, your tribe. So. Don't worry.